Hello and welcome to Wanders Elsewhere Gaming. On today's episode, I'll be showing you how you can get the Tega 6436. Building on strategies from our previous episode, we're using the International Paystar here. If you are just starting the game and do not have access to this truck yet, I recommend you take a look at my previous videos, find out how you can get it. The all-terrain tires that we have here are really what's going to allow us to get out to this location and fix this truck. I want to start out by just packing up and heading over to the Drowned Lands in Tamir, Russia. Equip yourself with a maintenance frame add-on, and then you're ready to head out. We've just arrived at the first sticky part of this journey. I haven't even gone into low gear put the diff lock on yet. But if you end up in the mud to the right, you could even get yourself stuck. Play it safe, take it slow, look for the deep stuff. If you haven't been to Russia yet, the mud here gets deep really quick, and if you're not lifted, you can find yourself bogged down. So for the most part on this journey, I'm gonna try to avoid the deep mud, keep it on the grass as much as I can. There's also really nasty roots that hide in the mud here in Russia. To get this accomplished at level 3, as we are, this does require three trips out to this location. So, drive out, use all your repair parts, recover, rinse, repeat. This trailer brings enough fuel to fill the take up in one go. Another strategy could be to drag a scout with repair parts behind you. Then you could probably get it done in two trips, but I'm not sure how much bringing that scout is going to slow you down. All in all, real time, I believe it only took me about 15 minutes to get this truck. And we've added another very capable vehicle to the roster in doing that. And the take is default stats. It's got a A power to weight ratio, A minus for durability. Fuel consumption gets a B plus. It has a pretty good fuel capacity at 330 liters, which is way above our pay star right here at 240. Also, at level 3 when we're acquiring it, we'll be able to put 47 inch all-terrain tires on it. So doubling our all-terrain capability here at level 3, giving us more options on what we want to do and how we want to play the game. If you're level 4, you have access to the ban add-on, and that'll give you way more repair parts. Definitely allow you to do this in two trips. Keeping this one short and sweet this time. You'll be able to see the map location for the Tega shortly, so, so you don't have to have that route memorized there. If you've enjoyed this video, please feel free to like and subscribe. I think my plan for the next edition is going to be to jump over to Alaska and go get ourselves the Royal BMC. Another very capable truck for our garage. We'll have a lot of starting options. Alternatively, we could try to get the quarry unlocked here in Russia allow us to get to Zimengorsk and unlock the ever-popular Tuz 420 Tartarin APC. If you got any thoughts on that, leave me a comment, let me know, and I'll catch you on the next one.